My name is Renison Jeffrey, and this is the Workers' Rights Platform. Now, we must ask ourselves one question. Did the contractor who is working on the road in Chatham, did he abandon his job? Or Kennedy is lying? Which one? You're in Chatham already. Just go a little way down the hill. Take your time on that. Eh? Aye, man. Right, no heavy vehicle is supposed to be passing on this, but this is one going down. Right. So we ask some folks to share this live. We do it on the personal page. Right. So we don't in Chatham. Um, they would have had a protest yesterday here. Right. This is one of the roads I have spoken on many times, calling on the MP, the mayor, the minister of works, even the prime minister. This has been here more than three years, this situation, and it has gotten worse, right? Um, they have stopped the school buses, the, the gas trucks, and other heavy vehicles from passing on this road, right? And I'm going to show all the why, right? My name is Anthony Nicholas Williams. I'm the leader of the Trinidad Tobago Democratic Front, and I'm calling on all citizens in Trinidad Tobago, fellow Trinbagonians, to call on the the administration, the PNM administration and the Prime Minister to call the local elections now. Call it now. This should be the call of all citizens across the country. Right? So we would have put this out many times on the behalf of the Chatham people. Right? This is what the Chatham people is driving on. Um, we had a situation here where um, our grandfather would have been driving with his kids and the car had a skid and he almost went off this precipice. Right? So we have one side of the situation, this situation here. A couple of weeks when I passed through here, where I did a live on it also, right? But now it has gotten more thinner, right? Who are passing on this road, they are taking a chance with their lives and their family lives. So this is the, the road that the citizens them have to pass on.